Cause after the after party, we're gonna keep it going. We're gonna rip it up. The neighbors might complain. Hi guys, thanks for tuning into Pop Flash. I'm Katie Day, and today I'm gonna be creating this Charlie X Gex makeup look inspired by her new video, After the After Party. So stay tuned if you want to see how I created this look. So today I'm going straight in with my eyes. I'm gonna be using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance Palette. So I'm going to start by taking my M433 brush and I'm going to be using the colour Venetian Red and I'm simply going to be taking the colour into my crease and buffing it in. And then I'm just going to be taking another blending brush and make sure that we're really blending the edges. Now I've blended the colour both into my creases, I'm going to be taking the same colour and the same um, brush and I'm simply going to be patting the colour right up to the crease. I'm just going to take a clean blending brush and make sure that's perfectly blended out. Next I'm going to be taking my NYX Matte Black Liner. Once you've done a winged liner on both sides, the next step is to add some lashes. So today I'm going to be applying the Huda, Blue, Huda Beauty Lashes in Samantha. Next step is moving on to the skin. So I've already applied a little bit of foundation onto my skin already. And in this video, the real emphasis I feel on the glossy bits with the eyes and the lips. So we're gonna come back to the eyes a little bit later to add a little bit of gloss. And of course we'll be making the lips super glossy. So in order to have a good balance, um, and especially in the video Charlie's using, her skin was quite matte. So my favorite affordable matte foundation is this Maybelline Dream Velvet Matte Foundation. So I buffed that already all over my skin for a nice base. Then I'm going to be using the Select Cover Up by MAC just to conceal with. Then I'm going to take my Beauty Blender and I'm going to just tap it just to blend that in. Then just to ensure that my base is super matte, I'm going to be using this original RCMA non color powder and this is the most amazing translucent powder ever. It's really light um, and just gives you a super matte coverage without giving you too much coverage. So with my Real Techniques brush I'm just going to be dabbing that all over my skin for full matte coverage. Then to add a little bit of red underneath my eyes I'm going to be using the blending brush. I'm not going to add any more product to it. I'm just going to see if there's enough product just to go underneath the eyes just to add a little bit of that pinky red. And as you can see, there's still quite a lot of product left on the brush. So I'm just going to blend that in. So I'm just retaking this Charlotte Tilbury Highlight and Contour Palette. And with my contour brush, I'm just gonna be adding a little bit of warmth into the cheekbones so we're not completely pale, but not too much. Next, I'm going to be moving on to the lips, and today I'm going to be using the Beat Lip Liner by MAC and also the lipstick in All Fired Up. So Charlie in this video didn't have a harsh lip line, it was quite a smudge, pinky, glossy lip. So I'm going to be using this lip liner very lightly to begin with. As you can see very loosely, I've gone round my lip line. Then I'm going to be taking the All Fired Up by MAC and I'm simply going to be patting it inside that loose lip line that we've just done. Now I'm going to be adding a little bit of gloss to the lips and the eyes because in the video she had super glossy eyelids and lips. Basically wherever it was really pink it was also glossy. So I'm going to simply be taking the Bobbi Brown lip gloss and like I did the lipstick I'm just going to be diving it all over my lips. Then with a the flat brush I'm going to be pressing the gloss into the centre of the eyelid. So guys, this is the end of the tutorial. So this is my the final makeup look 
created by myself, Katie Jane, for Pop Plush and inspired by Charlie XCX's new video after the after party. Stay tuned for upcoming tutorials.